that developing tonight new details in the knife attack last night at the Atlanta airport that ended with three people stabbed heading to the hospital. We have confirmed at least two of those victims have since been released from the hospital. 11 Alive's Tracy A. McPeer live from the airport tonight with what she's learning about how police are responding. Well, the entire incident last night took place before the airport security checkpoint. And today, Atlanta police tell me they have increased their police patrols here at the airport. Tonight, Atlanta police have now released an incident report from the violent attack at the airport. According to investigators, at around 445 Wednesday evening, a 44-year-old woman stabbed her cab driver in the chest while on the interstate. Then she got out at the airport and stabbed a Delta employee. Next, according to Atlanta police, the suspect refused to drop her knife. Officers unsuccessfully tried to tase her two different times and then used pepper spray. That's when APD Lieutenant David Cannon slipped in the pepper spray and the woman stabbed him in the leg. Another officer took her into custody. Now it all happened in a matter of minutes. The woman went before a judge this morning in Clayton County. She's charged with four counts of aggravated assault and was denied bond. Atlanta police also tell us that Lieutenant Cannon is now out of the hospital recovering and Delta Airlines confirms their employee stabbed in the chest during the attack is also out of the hospital and recovering. Now the suspect's next hearing will take place on November the 13th. Reporting live from the airport, I'm Tracy A. McPeer, 11 Alive News.